Hey guys, it's Jasmine and I'm so happy you're here. Today we are doing a Culver's mukbang if you can't tell by the blue in the back. I got real screwed over at Culver's during my what the person in front of me gets. So we are here and I ordered what I wanted this time and I also got something I've never tried before so I'm pretty excited but we got a lot of food. First off, I just turned the car off for you guys. You're welcome. <laughs> First off, we got a concrete mixer. My favorite, Oreos and cookie dough. I am so excited. This is everything I wanted and more. When I'm craving ice cream, I come here because this is so freaking good. I know it's frozen custard and not ice cream, but man, it's like better. Um, these are, oh, that's what it's for. Chili cheese fries. And this is what I've never had. So we are definitely trying something new today. <laughs> and pretzel bites. I just got a bunch of sides because that's kind of the mood I was in. So there's that. There's that. There's that. Hmm. Oh, oh. Wait, what's in here? Me trying to figure out everything that I actually ordered. Wait. I got two chili cheese fries. But marinara. I'm actually confused. I hope I got everything that I asked for. Here are my cheese curds to go with my marinara. I've also really been craving those. And a single mushroom with Swiss. Just what the doctor ordered. Alright, I'm going to take a quick thumbnail and I will be right back. Alright. We, I am so ready to get into this. First up, my mushroom Swiss burger. It's literally just a burger with mushrooms and Swiss cheese. And that is all. And it is my favorite thing to get from Culver's. There was no new foods that I was feeling or was in my area, so this is what we got. I think on Friday, though, we will have a new food. Either Friday or Monday. There's some coming out at the end of the month, so we'll get some. Had a little bit of a dry patch for about a week where no one was releasing dry new food, so that was kind of weird. But... I'm really excited about these chili cheese fries just because I've never had them. So this is what it looks like. I've never had chili from Culver's either, but I do love their cheese sauce. So we're going to dig right in to the middle here. Uh-oh. And almost tip the tray over. <laughs> Cheers. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, Culver's. Mmm, but it'd be so much better with sour cream on top. But it's good. I always get afraid of getting chili from fast food places because of my no onion thing. But I looked up their chili online before I came and it said it didn't have onions. So hopefully I don't get sick. I don't see any. I'm seeing celery. So... This is delicious. I'm sorry to everyone that doesn't have a Culver's near them because Culver's is definitely up there, like my top three favorite places. 
like Taco Bell, Cadoba, Culver's. Those are my three favorite fast food places. I should do a Cadoba video soon. I'd have to drive to a different town for one, but it's worth it for Cadoba, honestly, so. Well, oh my gosh. So at the bottom of this, to keep, I'm supposing, the chili from leaking through, they put a, um, like, rolled up wrapper, but it's just getting wet and ripping because it's just a wrapper. Anyway, as I was saying, I could just do a day trip on, like, the weekend and go film a couple meals since there's other restaurants about an hour away that I don't have here. Gosh dang with them lights. So that could be an option. Because that's where Chick-fil-A is. I wonder if they have a Panera. I'm about halfway through these fries. I also was really hungry. I've barely eaten today and it's 5 o'clock, so. Also, since it's 5 o'clock, the sun is starting to set, so it might get dark on us. We'll see. They're so good. I'm honestly just kind of trying to finish these because they're already getting soggy and I don't want soggy fries. I rate these fries a hmm, 7 out of 10. I would get them again, but I wouldn't get them every time. I have to be in the mood for them. Today is apparently that day. I was thinking about doing a cook with me, like, in my kitchen. But, would you guys watch that? I'm already on the YouTube, like, bad list. Like, my numbers are suffering out here. So... I'm only filming stuff if you're going to watch it. All right. Chili cheese fries are all gone. Uh, that's how much I liked them. So I would definitely recommend those to anybody who hasn't tried them before like me. Have some ice cream. If you're not a chili person, just get the fries and a cup of cheese sauce and do that. My windows are fogging up. I'm too warm. How much does the car sound bother you all? Because I've been told to turn my car off during videos I don't really notice it, but I don't want me having my car on to be the reason why people don't watch. So, let me know. I never told you what day it was. We're going to get into these pretzel bites. But it is Sunday night, or Sunday afternoon. It's 5 o'clock night or afternoon. I got cheese sauce. And the pretzel bites are actually my favorite side from Culver's. So... There's just something about them. They always tease us, or they did tease us with these before and take them away. Anywho, it is Sunday, which means tomorrow is Monday, which means I gotta go to work in the morning. And I hate Monday mornings. 
The only thing that keeps me going on a Monday morning is iced coffee, and that is the truth. If I forget it, you might as well just not talk to me. Any other day of the week, iced coffee is optional. Not Mondays. My body really ain't meant for that 9 to 5 schedule either. Or 8 to 5, whatever it is. It ain't meant for it. On the weekends, I naturally wake up at 9.30. That's just the time my body appreciates. I opened up my marinara. I'm going to start eating these. But, and then I take a nap at about one, just a half hour power nap. And if I could take a half hour power nap every afternoon at work, I think I'd do a lot better in life. There is a half hour break, but... I'm sure I'd be, like, frowned upon if I napped during it. I love cheese curds. Feel the need. The need for cheese. That is what I was feeling. That is why I was here. White or orange? Guess right now. Orange. Okay, I surprised you with that one, so we're going to do one more. White or orange? Three, two, orange. I had to double check because I'm looking in the viewfinder. <laughs> I'm getting full already. What is this? Those chili cheese fries were filling. Because I did not eat very much today. I should be fine. Can't get full during a mukbang. Calories don't count. I want to do some challenge videos. Like... 24 hour videos or trying this from this place or the most calorie or the most amount of money or videos like that so let me know what kind you want to see and where you want me to go I thought about doing one today but honestly I just wanted a good old mukbang just a lot of food want to hear something really crazy we live in Michigan And we haven't had a single snow day this year. So, that's kind of stupid. Because the big snowstorm landed during Christmas break. I do realize that a lot of people don't have a Culver's or have never had Culver's. And I'm really sorry. Because <laughs> whenever I have friends come to visit... They've never had it, or if I try and talk to them about it, they don't know what it is. I think it's very secluded to the Michigan area, like just the states that are right by us. Which is kind of crazy. I also heard, you know who you are, shout out to you. But that Culver's is changing from Pepsi products to Coca-Cola products. So, and I did Google it and I think it's true. It's just going to take a minute for them to roll it out. I asked for Mellow Yellow today and it was still a Mountain Dew. Because that's what my boyfriend likes. So, the funny part is that I did not mean to. Depending what place we're at, he either gets Mellow Yellow or Mountain Dew. And I forget what place has which. So I pull up and I'm trying to remember that, like what all I need to order because you can't order online here. And I did his first. And so I said, she says, what do you want to drink? I go, mellow yellow. 
she like gets nervous she's like oh no we don't have that and then she's trying to think and she's like what's the closest sierra mist and i'm like mountain dew so yeah so I'm just finishing my burger. And then I'm gonna go home. Watch some YouTube. Get ready for bed. And go to bed. Done with that. There's a loud truck for you. I don't think we can go a video without one pulling by. They like me. They're just everywhere, man. It's stupid. I don't understand. Like I do, but I don't. I will be eating this entire ice cream before I go to bed. That's the weird part about the frozen custard. If you do put it in the freezer, the texture changes. Or maybe it's just because it's in concrete mixer form. I don't know. Every time I try and save one of these for the next day, it's not good. And I'm not going to waste it. So that means I'm going to eat it. Oh. There's no shot I'm editing this tonight either. I'll edit it tomorrow. Right before you see it at 5 o'clock probably. <laughs> you know, I just like to live on the edge. I definitely would have filmed this at lunch on Monday too. Had it not been that I think we're having lunch with our boss tomorrow. <laughs> That is the only reason this is being filmed a day before. I really got to get better at that. That should be my New Year's resolution is to film videos before the day that they got to go live. It's never going bad though. And like it's not stressful for me. People always ask me how I eat ice cream when it's like snowing outside because it's really good and I just I don't associate cold and hot foods with the weather I just eat what I'm craving because most people on a day like today probably would go for like soup or chili or a warmer st style food because it is very cold but I'm eating ice cream Actually, I ate everything. I was about to wipe my hands off after eating ice cream. Habit, I guess. I'm going to end today's video here and go home and be with my cats before I got to go to work. Let me know if you have a Culver's and what your favorite item is from Culver's. If you've never tried a concrete mixture from Culver's, I would recommend that you definitely go do that. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a big thumbs up down below and hit that subscribe button if you would not mind. I am trying to get to a thousand subscribers, so it would really help me out and I would really appreciate it. Also hit the notification bell right next to it so you can be notified every time I post a video. I currently post videos every Monday and Friday at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I hope you all have a fantastic week and that your Monday was not too bad. And I will see you all on Friday. Bye, guys.